Liam, a long head-to-head, -head, neither man willing to break the stair. We are live, so within reason, can you tell us what you said to him at the end there? You know, I just said, look, you made the personal. You wanna, if you want to make it personal, I'll fully make it personal. Don't think I won't. So, you know, I just told Chris that he made the personal yesterday on a couple of things. Bringing my family into it, trying to slam my city, Liverpool. Um, he's in for a rude awakening tomorrow, let me tell you. All eyes on the scale, there was nothing between you. Um, how do you feel at this weight? Obviously, making weight isn't easy, but was it a little bit easier coming up to 160? Yeah, obviously, it was, it, it was a little bit easier, energy level-wise, but it was still come down to 160. And like I said, I think, don't, 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 be, don't be fooled that this is at 160 tomorrow and think that size is going to be a, be a big issue. What did you see when you looked at him, though, in terms of the weight and how he's made it? A clown, again. It's all just seen again. Clown, standing in front of me. With this build-up and everything, um, over the eight weeks, has your prediction changed? Has your confidence improved, if anything? No, it just stayed the same. I was 100% confident. I can't be no more confident than that. I was 100% confident when the fight got put to me. The camp I've had, the condition I'm in, I'm 100% confident here one day before this fight. Final word to you. Will you give us a prediction? A Liam Smith win and just obviously thanks to all the fans here for coming out again. Let's give him something tomorrow.